Hello friends, it's Jim over here. Today we are in St. Petersburg and it's very windy, so who knows what the sound's gonna sound like. <laughs> but we are at the factory and this is about an hour and a half or so from the major theme parks in Orlando. And it is an artist paradise. There is all sorts of little um, individual artists set up inside showing and selling their art. Um, they can also make you stuff, um, custom make you stuff. Uh, there is also the fairgrounds inside, which there's another video on the channel that you can watch with details about that. It is an amazing location if you are into art. So we're going to give you a little peek at it. So come inside. This gigantic warehouse building is the factory and it is an art lover's paradise. There is art everywhere you look made out of everything you can think of. And there are a lot of different elements that make up the factory, uh, including this right here. Fairgrounds is part of that. And you can see another video on this channel specifically about the fairgrounds. Um, but we'll touch on that briefly for a second uh, in just a moment. But like I say, everywhere you look, there is very, very cool art. And there are art galleries and... Uh, art studios and it, it's amazing as you can see here there's uh you know there's a museum of moms there's a, a a cool record shop but um we're gonna take a quick look right here at the fairgrounds this is that one little portion and this is a uh, a fully immersive art exhibit that just transports you into this other world and you can interact with everything, and it actually throws you into a mystery about a couple who have disappeared on their way to this motel. And um, if you look around and find clues, you are going to figure out that, well, there's some type of alien species involved, and you will end up on their spaceship trying <laughs> to figure out uh how to find these missing people and, and what actually happened. So that's the fairgrounds portion and it is amazing. Like I say, check out the other video about the fairgrounds. Uh, this is Daddy Cool Records, which is also in there. And again, another really cool record shop. They've got all sorts of albums and uh, uh, music video DVDs and uh, uh, musical equipment, turntables. And I was super excited because the first thing I saw when I walked in was this, the soundtrack to Reanimator. I love that movie, one of my favorite horror films. And I've never seen this album before. And it's, it's green vinyl. And that would be mine if it wasn't for the hefty price tag of $199. So yeah, I, I am not paying $199 for a piece of vinyl. But there's a lot of cool stuff you can buy in here, uh, different backpacks and cups and hats and shirts and stickers and lunch boxes and, you know, all rock and roll memorabilia, including this fun thing right here, this Barbie signature Bowie. Yep, there's the Barbie David Bowie. How cool is that? Now, the factory is very, very heavily art-inspired. Lots of artists in there, tons of artists in there. And they have their art present, and art is everywhere. On the walls, on the floor, on the ceilings. Any little thing that could have a painting or a drawing or something on it, it's probably got it on there. And you can walk through these halls in different rooms and just go from gallery to gallery. And these are original pieces of art. Um, this guy was amazing. A, a lot of, of, of ink and pen, pencil work, super detailed. And these are on display, but you can also buy them. There is a um, another little thing, and, and it, it wasn't open, so we didn't get to look at it, but this was the Museum of Motherhood, Mom. And I'm not really sure what's in there, but you can sort of see that there's, you know, her story and votes for women and things like that. So um, we have to come back and check that out. But that seems pretty interesting. But it's, uh, like I said, it's primarily an art gallery. Now, there's a, a big section 
where there are artists creating and painting and making things and you can buy it directly from them or have custom works done. And this was a candle guy who can make custom candles, all wax stuff right there. And he does the designs himself. They light up on, under the lights, which are very, very cool. Um, here's a woman who is doing some paintings and selling her paintings there from her booth. And as you walk through here, you see there's just booth after booth after booth of artists creating stuff. And, um, and, and you can take it home with you. So like I say, this is, this is an art lover's paradise. You could spend several hours here. I mean, probably two or three hours alone just in the fairgrounds portion. And then another couple hours just wandering through all these booths and checking it out. So definitely if you love art, stop by the factory in St. Pete, Florida. So there you go. That is a quick look inside the factory at St. Petersburg. Like I say, it's about an hour and 20, hour and 30 minutes from the major theme parks in Orlando. All kinds of cool stuff to look at for art. So if you're in the area and you're into art, you need to come down and check it out. So I hope you've enjoyed watching this video. If you have, click that like button to let the powers that be know that you like the video. And while you're at it, click on follow or subscribe and you'll be notified when I upload new videos. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you next time.